Claudio Martini at Resistance Training. Today, I'm going to give you the breakdown of the rotations on a day-to-day -day basis. So, instead of telling you the whole routine all in one video, which would make it very, very long, I'm going to do each workout in the rotation per video. So, there will be four videos on each of these templates. So, we'll get into it. So, let's do a double bicep, bouncing bicep pose. Looking good. Getting right up over 15, almost 15 and a half. Yep. Yes, sir. All right. So let's get to it. All right. So I'll be doing four of these videos. This will, the first one obviously is going to be template one, workout one. Okay. And how this is structured is that each workout is numbered because it's going to be each one for each day of the week. Usually, I do my workouts Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, Saturday, Sunday off. And then it just keeps, the, 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 the rotation just keeps on going. So today is going to be the first workout in the rotation, which consists of bench press, chin-ups, weighted, Tricep push downs with a cable and preacher curls. Four exercises in this template. Okay, that's what it consists of. Four exercises. And the rep ranges uh, per set will always vary. Okay, but if you're starting this routine, I would usually start with a five by five. That's correct. And so basically, if you do it that way, if you're starting out, uh, it's, it's just starting out on a five by five. OK. And as you get more advanced in in this routine, then you can do some modifications. I'm I don't set a set uh, a rep range. I don't set it in stone. It goes by feel because I've been doing this for such a long time now. I want to say this on these on this particular program I have been tweaking it for a long time so this is like my baby this has uh, it's been modified and remodified and I fit it to what my needs are so this is like my most beautiful creation so to speak you know my best you know soup du jour so I've been working on this and it's been and the way that I have it now I believe that it's very well perfected and we'll get into that as we go into this template and then we will move on and the next video will obviously be template number two so let's get started and I made a if you can see it this is basically the template right here if you can see that see that Bench, chin ups, tricep cable push downs, and preacher curl. All right. The reason I have it set up that way, okay, is that it, and almost, let me say this you're almost doing kind of almost like a whole body, but an upper whole body. So that's going to mean a lot as the templates continue, as you see the rest of the templates. You will start to put things together as we go along. So template one is going to be a bench press, a big compound move it, movement. It's put number one because that's where most of all your energy is going to be. And it's a big movement and it works a lot of muscle structures. Okay. The next one after that is chin-ups. Now, on that paper you didn't see weighted so I left it non weighted because obviously if you're starting out you might not be able to use weights on the chin up you follow what I'm saying so you might not be able to use weight weighted chin ups at this point in the workout so I just left it blank but 
I do bench press. Then I proceed with weighted chin-ups, okay? Then tricep cable push-downs and preacher curls. So as you can see that the way they're arranged is I'm hitting a big structure, the chest, which also hits the triceps, which also hits the shoulders. So, but the main focus on the bench is going to be chest. And then you have all the other secondary muscles coming into play, okay? Such as your triceps, your shoulders, and so on and so on. The next one is almost similar in, in that you're hitting the back reverse grip chin-ups weighted. So it's basically a lat back exercise, okay? But at the same time, you're also hitting other muscle structures such as the bicep, okay, and shoulders to an extent, your upper back, and you're hitting a lot of muscle groups. So in two movements, we've hit pretty much big structures of the muscle group, okay? Now we move on to which are more specific exercises to specific muscle groups. The next exercise now is going to be tricep pushdowns. And as you see, I always do, for instance, chin-ups are bicep going to be heavily dominated by bicep. That's why the tricep pushdown is after the chin-ups. So they complement each other. So the next exercise after weighted chins is tricep pushdowns, okay? And I, I pretty much blast those pretty hard. The next one after that, after tricep cable pushdowns, is going to be preacher curls, a very much, very, very isolated, you know, movement, okay? It's, it's not going to hit a lot of muscle groups. It's hitting very specific muscle groups of the arm. So that's why I do it the way it's written down and then the order. The order is very important. So you wouldn't want to do a bench press and do tricep cable pushdowns right after the bench because you've already hit your triceps in the big bench. So I put in the chin-ups to kind of give myself a little bit of, you know, if you're doing five to six sets of chin-ups, it's going to give the triceps and the chest a little bit of rest if you've gone heavy. So the, the way that they're put in in the workout, okay, is very, very, very specific. So that's why it's bench, chin-ups, tricep push-downs, and then preacher curls. Four exercises, just like there's four workouts, four templates. Now, I tried to get away with doing it with only three exercises, which in my opinion would be much better, but... I just, if you do that, I'm going to be leaving a lot of other things out that I really need to hit. And I don't want to be one of these guys that goes on to, I could have stuck to more basic, you know, uh, of a more basic compound movements. But then if you do that, you know, five, six years down the road, when you get stronger, you're going to look at your arms and other body parts that aren't as developed. And I think that's a lot of the mistake that these guys that strictly stay to just the basic movements. So I didn't want to do that. That's why this, this, this program is designed the way it is. So it's four exercises. So basically, if you're doing this template, five by five, you're going to have 20 sets in a given workout in this template. You know, five sets of bench, five sets of chins, five sets of tricep pushdowns, and then five sets of preacher curls for a total of 20 sets. All right. So there you have the first template. Okay. That template, this workout, can be started wherever fits your schedule. All right. And I do it because I like having the weekends off. It doesn't matter. You can set it up any way you want. But basically how it's going to run is, I'll give you an example, all right? And then you'll see it as we go along on the other templates that I put up. Example, this template, let's say we started, and by the way, today is Thursday. So this template for me, I just finished workout number uh, four, deadlifts and back, okay? 
And that workout was completed yesterday on Wednesday. So today's Thursday. So tomorrow, see what I'm saying? I will start over with template one, which is Friday. So tomorrow, I'm going to be doing this workout tomorrow, Friday. All right. But back to what I was saying is you can do it any way that fits your schedule. So I'll give you an example. I start, I, I like Saturday and Sunday off. So let's take an example on this particular program. Monday will be, let's say, number one, this workout that I'm just, now we're talking about. And then I take a day always in between off. Always take a day off in between. And then Wednesday will be template two which we'll discuss in the next video, but that's basically going to be lower body, okay? That'll be template two Wednesday. Then template three will be, uh, I mean, I'm sorry, we'll have, God, we have, I'll do this workout, template one on Monday, template two on Wednesday, which is a lower body, and then template three will be Friday, upper body again, shoulders and arms, okay? Saturday, Sunday off, completely off, and then come Monday, I will have the fourth workout, the fourth template, which will be, and we'll discuss it in more detail on that particular video for that particular template, will be deadlifts, okay, four-way neck machine, four-way neck machine on a Nautilus, or a neck, if you don't have the machine, do neck work at home. And then a wide grip lap pull downs with a cable, okay? And uh, yeah, yeah, and Pendelli rows. So four, four in that template. We'll discuss that when we do that video. But it's basically a lower and upper kind of a day. So you're doing it three times a week. So we're going to end here. But I want to just specify that each one of these workouts that you're going to see that uh, we're going to discuss is almost like a full body in a sense because you're hitting this template we're hitting large muscle groups chest shoulders you know we're hitting triceps biceps we're doing a lot of structures maybe not directly okay this one we are we're hitting arms directly pretty pretty hard and chest and back we're hitting so it's almost like a full body but an upper full body you see what I'm saying come come uh, the second template which we'll discuss on the next video which is going to be lower body the reason I do it as a number two in the workout program is because it gives me kind of a break in between the upper and the lower so today we discuss template one okay workout one in the rotation okay and these rotate continuously and this is very important to understand so if I go Monday uh, 1 Wednesday 2 Friday 3 Saturday Sunday off and then come uh, Monday again we do fourth the fourth template then come Wednesday of that following week We'll start with one again, the one we're discussing here, and so on and so on. So if you were to write this down on paper and put each of the following days of the week on a calendar, you will see that each workout is, is done on the every ninth day of the rotation. So you're doing it every ninth day. So the beauty about that is... It's going to give you a lot of rest, and it's going to give you the ability to push hard, get your rest, and be able to recuperate. And you're working hard. You're going to be working hard at the same at the same time. And in this particular program, you're going to have to do as you get stronger. You'll have to do some readjustments here and there because the stronger you're going to become, the uh, usually you're going to have to kind of modify on the sets and reps and that's why I said they're not written in stone you're going to have to come to a point where you're going to have to you're going to have to auto regulate at some point you see what I'm saying 
That's why they're not. But if you're starting out, you can go five by five. But remember, this is a demanding program. It's not, believe me, five by five is pretty demanding on four exercises. You may not think so looking at it on paper. But if you're pushing like I am, it can be very draining. The tricky part is, is when you have the two lowers the following week. All right, but we'll get to that. So today, let's redo a review today. Bench press, okay, chin-ups weighted, triceps cable push-downs, and preacher curls. That will be done tomorrow. That is template one. That will be number one for my rotation for Friday, Saturday, Sunday off, come Monday. We will do number two, okay, which will be legs, okay. So, there you have it. We'll get uh, the next video out here when I can, which will be template two. Today we discussed workout one. Here we go, another <coughs> awesome. There you go, bro. I'm growing like a weed, and this thing is working phenomenal. And remember, this is my baby. I've been tweaking this thing for the last year, two, year and a half, almost two years fine-tuning it to find exactly, it's like fine wine, you know, you got to do it just right to put the exercises where they belong and how to get everything coordinated and not to do a ton of overlap. It's very important, so please watch these templates and try to absorb them and, and, and get them. Try to get them drilled in and you'll see it and do this program. So, We'll see you soon. We will talk about template number two, which is going to be legs. Talk to you soon. We're out of here. Where is the button? All right, Claudio Martini, we're out of here.